So in today's episode of Mom Buzzle, we finally go get our race car. We're going to go try to unlock the racetrack. And folks, it is time to start to upgrade our other car. So if you guys are excited for some more Mom Buzzle, be sure to hit that thumbs up button and let's jump in. Uh, it's another beautiful morning here in Canada. And folks, I think today is going to be the day that we unlock the racetrack. So I've been grinding away a little bit. You can see I've got a decent bit of money. I'm going to save it, though. I think eventually I want to do an episode where we just upgrade all of the maple syrup stuff, but I think it would probably be good if we did that maybe within the next episode or two. That way I can make that whole process even faster, but I've gotten efficient at it. Uh, I really like it. All right, so let's have a little bit of breakfast here. And yeah, we're ready to go talk to the guy. So oh, and let's go see. Wait, okay, we're going to take the ATV. I got to remember what I'm doing. Yeah, we're taking the ATV because we're actually going to leave it at the uh, the old junkyard. Uh, you can see my car in here. I haven't done anything to it. Like, I want to do an episode about upgrading this. So we still just have all the parts. Actually, where are the parts? Uh, the transmission. Oh, yeah, I put it over here. So, yeah, here's the transmission. And we do have to take these by the, uh, the main store and we'll mount some wheels. I need to buy some more tires. I've got two more I need to get. And, uh, yeah, we can do that. Uh, and then eventually get the transmission on. But first, uh, let's take this here. So we spotted a, uh, a new car, which we drove it around for just a couple seconds uh, at the junkyard. We're going to take that one and race it. And then we'll uh, upgrade this vehicle and get it race ready. And we'll take it to the racetrack eventually too. Okay, that's cranked there. All right, let's grab this. This is kind of awkward. I think my brake's on. There we go. But yeah, uh, there's a lot that I need to accomplish here. Uh, today, but I'm excited. I don't know what this racetrack is going to actually hold. Like, are we going to race against other cars or is it a time trial? What do we win? Like, is there money involved? Uh, that would be kind of cool, too. So, yeah, uh, let's head over to the store. I need to fill up on gas to make sure the race car has enough gas, and then we'll head over to the junkyard and pick up our sweet new ride. Holy man, I just now remembered. Is the gas station? Yeah, the gas station's open on Saturdays. It's everything that's open or closed on sundays and the maple place is closed on sunday i believe oh let's go through here all right let's go ahead and talk to the guys yes they're here cool uh let's go ahead and do that and let's make sure we unlock the racetrack here boom and hello boom how are you let me think about it but that would be so expensive wait what did that not unlock it Wait, what level do we have to be to unlock this? I thought this was going to be 25. What? So I just read a little bit into the form because I thought everything was level 25. You do not get the racetrack until level 50. So I also read, and I actually didn't know this, there's another side activity that you can do to make your friendship go up a little faster, apparently. And it's an activity that I can't show on YouTube. <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. So, you know what? We're going to go retrieve our race car, and we're going to switch up the episode. We're going to mount the tires on the other car and try to upgrade it real quick. Uh, that way, it will be race ready, plus we'll have the pink car. But, folks, we don't get to drive the racetrack. I thought it was a level 25. Uh, it actually took me reading the form, which I typically don't like to do a lot of uh, because I don't want to spoil the game. But that's a little weird. Yeah, it's level 50, so... It's either 25 days or we do a couple things that I can't show on YouTube, which I'm sure some of you know about. Uh, and I find a way to get that racetrack unlocked a little bit faster. Uh, I will do it. It might take a couple episodes though now. Well, let's at least go get our pink race car. Also, real quick, by the way, can I use your lift? Like, I feel like it, eventually they're going to make it to where you can open up this garage and use the lift because I'm still trying to play in my head how we're going to change the transmission. I mean, we could find a janky way to flip it over. Here's the tire changer, which we get to use that here in a bit. Is there a jack? Uh, oh, yeah, there's calipers here that we need to buy. We probably need to come back to the store here in a bit and just buy a bunch of the parts to fix the, uh, the one car. But you know what? I'm staying true to my word here. We are going to go uh, get that stupid race car all right here we are once again i don't know if this thing's replenished anything uh all right here we go i don't think there's anything we need to grab i think we pretty much got everything so uh real quick i record these videos uh pretty far out ahead so there's a chance i haven't gotten to read the comment section on the junkyard episode 
Uh, so there might be uh, some... Or actually, I had some questions about if this thing replenishes or not. Uh, I don't see anything, like, right off the bat. So there's a chance maybe in updates he'll add stuff for you to grab around here, which would be kind of cool. All right, I did a quick little look over. I think everything's good to go here. Here we are. We got our race car. Yeah, buddy. On, right, crank up. Come on. There it goes. I probably should have put the gas in here. I mean, how much gas does it have? Is there a gas gauge? I don't see one, but we'll just uh, fill it up when we get to the house or if it runs out on the way home. But yeah, we're just going to leave the ATV here because I really, like, don't use it much. Uh, so I might as well just go ahead and stay here. Uh, eventually, if I want to walk all the way over here, I guess I can come retrieve it one day. But not too worried about it right now. We have a new vehicle. I'm happy about this. <laughs> so another thing I said about getting gas. Uh, thankfully, I brought it. Yeah, this thing is dead. Uh, okay. Brakes. Is there a handbrake? Is there a parking brake on this thing? I don't know if there is. Uh, okay. Uh, oh, here it is. Okay, are we... Nope. Brake. There we go. Oh, well, I guess we gotta put gas in it. <laughs> Ooh, we are lucky we brought that, aren't we? Okay, uh, race car is full. Hans, tighten that down there. Nice. Okay. Uh, let's hope that was the problem and it's not something else. All right, so ignition on, starter. There we go. Uh, man, it sounds sick. What's going on? Oh, parking brake. I'm stupid. There we go. All right, full tank of gas. This should get us home now. You know, I must say this thing is pretty sporty. I don't know if it's faster than our other car, uh, but yeah, this thing's nice. Oh, geez. Okay. Uh, we're just going to fly around here. Oh, okay. Hold on to it. Hold on to it. Uh, it's a little unpredictable at times. Uh, it's definitely, it feels tighter than the other vehicles for some reason. Like, it does not feel like it gets as sideways. Um, brake, 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 brake. Oh, jeez. Okay, never mind. I, I might have lied to you guys right there. Oh, we are hauling right now. Oh, let's go through the... Oh, no. Oh, that's a tree. Oh, jeez. Okay, we are flipping and landed it. Got it. Holy man, how does it still run? All right, uh, well, I guess we can pull this one into the garage. Uh, oh, need to open up the garage door. Okay, here, we're going to back this one in there like a true racer. There we go. Brakes. Uh, let's hop out real quick, leave it running. It sounds pretty cool. Uh, I'm not going to lie. Let's go ahead, open that. There we go. Do we have gas over here? Uh, we need to fill that up with gas. Uh, but, yeah, I'm really liking this car. Uh, I'm guessing it's just, like I said, paired with the racetrack. Even though I'm sure you're supposed to race your other car, too. Go. Oh, I can't see out the back of this. Uh, might. Okay, I might hit my other car. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Did I really just do that? Oh, might have. Let's go forward a little bit. And let's go reverse. Swing it in. Oh, I'm totally hitting my other car. Uh, this is fine. Uh, you know what? Let's just leave it outside the garage probably a better idea there we go all right well we have retrieved the race car so on to this car how do we get this in here can i just shove this down through the floorboard and call it a day uh, i don't think that's a thing oh just drop that it's fine so what i could do we could do this all at the store if i wanted to i don't know that might be a pain in the butt let's are these winter tires these totally have some sort of like spikes in them yeah, so we need two more all-season tires. I wish this came with the tire changer. I, I don't really know why it didn't. There's a chance you can get one for it. Uh, but, yeah, we're definitely going to need to go mount those. So we should probably go to the store before they close. Let's go buy the other new tires, and then we can at least upgrade the tires on there. Uh, buy bolts, buy uh, the rust kits and all that other good stuff. Uh, so let's go do that. Plus, I need some food and some more maple syrup. All right, here's my two favorite people of all time. Let's go ahead and close that. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and see how this works. I've never used this, so what we go clunk, and then we just pop a tire on, and that's it. Uh, these tires, they look a little worn, but man, I think they're good. Uh, okay, so we go boom. All right, so it's $15 to do that. All right, so that's going to go on. Where do I put my transmission? How do you put that in there for me? Okay. Uh, I might have to actually read the form on that one. Let's go boom. Uh, let's grab our next rim. Plus, we'll have to buy two tires from him. Let's go boom. And then we got one more salvage tire. Okay, you do that, sir. I need one of those and one of those. There we go. 
He's loving me because he's making all my money. Okay, next one up, boom, and boom. You take care of that. Man, these tires look pretty sweet. All right, let's put that back there. Grab that. Or if I try to shove a radio in his face, if he would buy it. Uh, okay, let's put this down here. And then last one here. That is a set of basically brand new tires, except for the ones I got from the uh, the junkyard. But heck, why spend an extra 200 and something dollars for the fresh tires when you can get some uh, all wheel or all season tires? I mean, they don't look that much different. I mean, they kind of are. We'll like pair those in the back or something. I wonder if it actually affects grip. That's a good question. Okay, so those are in the back there. So I got some other stuff I need to buy from you. Uh, here, let me get some energy real quick. So, do I have a dent? I'm sure there's a dent in that car, right? I know I need these rust repair kits, so let's go ahead and load these up. And we are doing a full-blown upgrade day today. All right, let's get both of those. Uh, we're going to spray it a new color, too. I feel like we need to upgrade this as much as possible. Uh, what color do I want to go with? There's a clear coat, a scion blue, pink, yellow... I feel like green's gonna be fast. Let's do this. So let's get our Bob Rust spray can in there. All right, what else are we gonna buy from you? Uh, probably gonna buy, we should probably upgrade the brake rotors. Uh, I don't know, is that upgraded? Uh, also, I think potentially the guy in the shady van sells uh, parts sometimes. I don't know, maybe we should hold off on these. Uh, I haven't looked at the calipers. I'm sure they're bad, uh, but yeah. You know what? That's all we're buying from you, buddy. Except for a couple more maple syrups because I need these at the house. You know what's funny? I make so much maple syrup that I still go over here and buy his maple syrup. I don't know what's wrong with me. I have a storage full of maple syrup. Like, I should just be drinking that, right? Uh, maybe we should do that. But of course, next episode, maybe we'll buy all the upgrades and maybe we'll do the canning thing, which can we drink our own cans? I'm assuming we can. Okay, I gotta be really careful. I've got so much stuff in the back that has the potential to fly out. I need to go get some poutine though. We're gonna load up on all of that. Hey, the weather's getting kind of gross here. I feel like it's about to start raining or something. Oh, we better turn on our uh, headlights here. Wait, we have bed lights? Yo, that's pretty cool. All right, so yeah, let's head home real quick. Uh, we'll start working in the garage, and yeah, we're going to do some upgrades. Uh, I still have a couple questions about things that I potentially need to do. I need to look at the uh, the calipers and brakes uh, because potentially we'll need to buy those. But I want to see if that guy with the van shows back up uh, because I could have swore I saw parts uh, that he had that were upgrade parts for the car, and they looked pretty sweet. All right, honey, we are home and we are ready to start upgrading this. Let's pull this back a little bit. Also, I want to see if that front bumper stays on. Yeah, having a manual transmission in here would be kind of cool instead of this automatic. Okay, you pile of poo. Let's do this. Uh, let's go get our tools. We'll get our tires out uh, here. Let's go ahead and pull these real quick. Okay, so here's our dent kit. Can we use this more than once? Like, do we even have dents in here? Yeah, look at the top of this. So if I go clunk, oh, 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 look at that. It's cleaning up the roof. Nice. Okay, it's fully restored. But yeah, I'm just clicking on the uh, panels that let me click. Uh, this is nice. We're obviously uh, restoring stuff here. Man, this thing's gonna look clean. Also, I swear there's gotta be a wing somewhere. Cause look at the, uh, the holes in the, uh, trunk here. Uh, that's obviously a thing somewhere. Uh, did I do everything, uh, that I possibly could with this? I think so. Okay, well, let's just keep that over there. This is a good tool. Plus, you can, uh, reuse it. Okay, here we go. Rust kits. Let's hit that, which I don't know what that really just did. It didn't look like it did anything there. And then I got one more I can use here. Go yoink. There we go. Yep, there's still like the need for another like four or five rust kits. It's fine. Also, we have a little miracle radio in here. How did that stay in there? You know, at one point I had like three or four. I'm pretty sure uh, a lot of them have flown out. I stored a couple, but there's still at one in there. All right, let's spray paint this. Hold on, can I spray paint the bumper here? There we go. I'm liking this uh, really nice green. I think we might keep the... Uh, uh, the old hood, the way it is, but I think I want the body to be green. Okay, we are finishing up the last panel here. Look at that. You gotta admit, that's pretty clean looking. Oh, I know we forgot this one panel. It's fine. There we go. Beautiful. I mean, gotta knock a little more of the rust off, but uh, this is turning out 
decent, I would say. Of course, that's probably my motto for everything. It's like, this is decent. Uh, how do we get these off? We just unscrew. What if I just do the center here? Wait, what is this unscrewing? That seems like something we would need. I wonder if that's how we get to the transmission. Uh, just unscrew the whole bottom. Uh, this is fine. You know, this is actually kind of tedious, not gonna lie. We better screw the big one back in. Uh, here, let's put this back in real quick. Uh, we just need to unscrew the tire. We'll look at the, the calipers and stuff. Uh, but I don't want to undo something in that, uh, is gonna make the whole car fall apart. Okay, so here's a question. Does it come off now? i put that there. Uh, maybe we do have to do that. Wait, what is that? Oh. Oh, there we go. Yeah, these things are old and busted. These are our winter tires. We'll just stick those over there. Uh, so here, let's stick the new ones on. Yeah, it definitely is rusty. Uh, that's something we need to work on. Let's go boom. Okay. Uh, do these need air in them or something? They just look really low. Hold on, let's put these in. Uh-oh. These take a different bolt? No, no, they don't. Okay, let's go ahead and put these in real quick. Yay, we only have to do this four more times. Or three more times, I should say. Komodo, learn to math here. All right, these things are going to need a lot of air here. Hold on, there we go. Yep, there's zero PSI in here. I mean, I guess that makes sense. We just mounted it. Uh, oh. Wait, what's a good PSI for a tire? Isn't it like 30 to maybe 34? Oh, uh, let's see what what makes it look normal. Uh, let's go 35. That looks pretty good. So yeah, I mean, that's the thing. So we upgrade the other wheels. Uh, maybe we'll try to take apart the, uh, the engine and stuff. I think that will uh, lead down to the transmission. Plus, I need so many more of those rust packs to just get rid of the rust over here. You know, one thing I would like to see in the game, and I know the dev watches, uh, maybe the option on the computer for a website that would deliver either to your uh, post office box or maybe even to your house uh, to maybe where you can buy some extra parts. Uh, say the one guy doesn't have everything in stock because I kind of feel like that'd be a good idea. But yeah, we're doing it. We are upgrading our vehicle. All right, well, the new wheels are on. It's getting late. My power just went out. So yeah, we need to refill the generator. I need to figure out how to connect to the grid too. Uh, but yeah, I think this is about where we're gonna call it because we had a very successful episode. I'm super happy with what we've done. Uh, thank you guys for all of the support on the series. You guys are absolutely amazing. We'll see you guys next time.